the relationship between policy and software is a really interesting one. When policy is specified, we think that we've covered all of the, the little details that are required for the planning and implementation of a project. But we frequently find when we go to implement the policy in software that there are all sorts of things that we left out. And all the more so when you're trying to implement a policy that somebody else has written. Opal is the third generation of a software implementation of the Colombian Offset and Mitigation Policy. There's an inability to express things with appropriate precision sometimes, and it's easy to leave out small details that a computer and a computer program really needs to have very specifically defined. And there are many cases that we came across in the development of Opal and MathIT where we had to make certain assumptions uh, that were reasonable given the decision context and fill in various gaps that the policy simply just left something out. We worked closely with our partners in Colombia to ensure that the final tool accurately reflected the intention of the policy. So this is, all, this is one of the really interesting things about working with software that operationalizes policy. This isn't just a matter of what do people want. We have to develop software that is correct even when the policy is missing things. So how do you make something like that correct? Well, we have this feedback loop with our partners and with the government agencies that are involved. And that those decisions that are made end up finding their way into the software. Opal is ultimately a generalized version of the Colombian decision context and the limitations of that context and our understanding of the policy for that context. We look forward to hearing from you, our users, about how Opal could be useful to you or is useful to you already in your particular decision contexts. And with your feedback, we can make Opal better for everyone together.